everybody so today i'm gonna do a cow makeup i've been seeing this i've been wanting to do this forever for years and i never tried it because i don't have like ears um i'm gonna see if i can make some with paper if not we're just gonna do the makeup um but i'm super excited this is a super easy halloween look in my opinion um and i like showing you guys kind of easy looks so we're going to start with the base and we're going right into it. We're turning ourselves white. We're going to look like a cow. So I'm using these cream paints from Cristal Cosmetics and I'm going to use the white and just with like a beauty blender. Just um, so let's do this. We're just going to blend out our paint and you're just going to do your whole face. Um, you do want to set it with a white eyeshadow or translucent powder. Okay. So this is gonna take a while, I'm gonna fast forward it. Okay, we got our paint done. Um, it looks a little patchy, but we are gonna, you know, put eyeshadow and the cow cow print, um, you know, the cow print. So we're gonna set it real quick with a setting powder, but it's super white, so we'll see if this helps a little. But I believe this one needs to give flashback. <laughs> so we'll see if this works for setting our makeup. So the first thing we're gonna do is gonna be our eyeshadow. We're gonna do blue eyeshadow because I think it's gonna look so pretty. Um, and that's the picture that I have as my inspo. Um, she has blue eyeshadow. I'll put it right here and it looks so beautiful. So we're gonna do blue eyeshadow. This palette by Cristal and we're gonna use the blue shades. So let's, let's start with that first. So I went ahead and just did a regular eyeshadow look like I always do. Um, I I didn't do a cut crease. I just kind of added the lighter shades you're going to see right now. Um, I blended out the darker blue and then I went in with a, like a baby blue. And the baby blue, I put it on the lid as you see here. And then I went in with white on the inner corner to make it a little lighter. And I really liked how it ended up. Then we went ahead and did our eyeliner with the Urban Decay Perversion Liner. Ugh, I love this eyeliner. It makes it so easy. If you guys can see, this eyeliner was super fast and it looked so sharp and so pretty. Um, we went ahead and did both eyes. Now we're done with the eyeshadow. Now we're going to do our blush and I'm going to use this. You want to go with like a pink peachy shade? Just smile and put some blush on. Mm-mm. Our cows have to be blushy. This is a glam cow, so she needs some blush. There's Juvia's Volume 2, and I'm using both shades, actually. It looks crazy right now, but trust the process. I look like a clown. Okay, now we're going to do our eyebrows, and we are actually going to just draw a line. And I'm going to use the water-activated paints um, with some MAC Fix Plus, and we're going to go into the black. Just drawing it. I do not... Um, I do not use the glue stick to cover my eyebrows because I never tried it, and I've, I'm kind of scared it's going to rip out my hair. So I, you know, just work around my eyebrows. So this cow's going to have some brows. Now we're going to start drawing our cow print. You just want to do random spots. Here we go. I'm super scared, but here we go. So 
So I'm just doing random spots with the water activated paints and you want to kind of, you know, keep going in there and making sure that you're making it as dark as you can because you're going to fill it in later. Like you see right here, I did do some smaller spots and some bigger spots um, just to, you know, whatever you like, just kind of if you want a reference photo, look one up um, and then you just fill them in and done. What do y'all think? Um, this is super cute. I know they sell cow ears at like places like headbands and stuff you can get that and then do this makeup and you have a cow look wear um a white shirt or find a cow shirt they also sell cow onesies like pajamas so you guys this is super easy super facile you guys ah i'm obsessed i love the way it looks i cannot wait to take pictures right now um i love it and the blue eyeshadow i love blue so if you guys try this out let me know in the comments and yeah be on the lookout for more videos um october ain't over i have this week this whole week i'm gonna try to pop out a lot of videos because the following week is baby girl's birthday which is the last week of october and i'm gonna be super busy with her birthday stuff so probably get another week worth of makeup looks but i'm super excited i have many more i want to do so yeah hope you guys have a great day bye